Life like this sure is sweet, huh? It definitely is. <laughs> Listen, I've had enough of your shit. Okay, all of these road to the final cards are too expensive. If only there was a really good one that was also cheap. Allow me to introduce you to Moses Simon. He has incredible power. Oh my god! <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ! Are you trying to traumatize children? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It's fucking amazing. I gotta tell you, it was perfect. Everything, down to the last minute details. Are you sure about that? I'm good. Bro, are you, you okay? I'm good, bro. Are you okay, bro? I'm good. Bro, bro. Bro, I'm good, bro. Are you struggling to win on FIFA because your team is really bad? Shocking, dreadful, no quality. Do you need coins for a cheeky new team? I need it! You can head over to u7buy.com for cheap, fast and reliable coins. You can use the link in the description, use code Mitchell and get a 5% discount. Alright boys and girls, today is going to be a very cheeky day, okay? Today boys are going to be looking at Moses Simon, okay? He's got himself an absolutely insane card and he's just dirt cheap. Now I understand that the meta is a little bit different this year, okay? You know, you, the, the sort of more bigger type strikers are actually pretty OP at the minute. But that shouldn't mean that Moses Simon is not going to be absolutely broken, lads. The stats on this card are incredible, okay? He does not have the best shooting, I will admit. But I'm hoping with a chem style, you know, that's not going to be a problem. So anyway boys, I've built a very, very cheeky team around him, okay? I'm not going to lie to you lads, this team took me a while to build because chemistry is an absolute bitch this year. So I spent quite a long time trying to get this to work with full chemistry. I did unfortunately have to get Sissoko who is actually a pretty good card but I just don't like the fact that he's non-rare. I don't know if anyone else is like that who just doesn't like using non-rare players. Fuck off you, you fat useless sack of fucking Yankee danky doodle shite. Fuck off will you please yeah. But that side lads, I think the rest of the team is very cheeky. I mean there's a lot of players in here that I've not used yet like this guy for example that I got from, uh, what was it? What was it again? It was, um, it was season progress. That was it and yeah this card looks for, he looks ridiculously overpowered. You guys know as well that I love me some Ozzyman, so we've got him in here to try. We've got a Sambo and Guisa, so yeah, there's a, there's a lot of good cards in it that I want to try out. All right, then, boys, let's not waste any time, okay? Let's jump straight into the in games of this Moses Simon, okay? So, starting things off, five foot six, high, medium, work rate, four star, four star. Now, obviously, that's a very good start, lads, and a five foot six should, I, I think, in theory, make this card an absolute baller. 95 pace, lads. I mean, the fact that this card has got that pace this early in the game, I mean, fuck me, that's actually nuts. Now, the shooting, lads, is why this card is probably a little bit on the cheaper side okay the shooting is really not that good and usually i don't like cards that you know can't really shoot that well but to be fair you know with the chem star he does get plus 15 on finishing which is definitely going to help and i've yet to use a card like this this year you know i've used a lot of high finishers i've yet to use a card that's got you know low end finishing so you know we'll find out today if it's actually going to impact the card or not passing stats here lads are okay you know they're not amazing but you know they're, they're, they do the job but the dribbling lads oh my god the dribbling i mean just look at that like uh, this is we are like a couple weeks into FIFA, man. And I'm seeing 96 agility and 98 balance. Like, that should be illegal. Wow! What the fuck, bro? Like, what the fuck? And if finally, physically, that's actually quite surprisingly good, okay? For some reason, this 5'6 lad has 97 jumping, so I don't know if that's gonna... I mean, it's probably not gonna matter, but he has it. Plus, the stamina is all right there, and the strength is actually pretty good for someone who's 5'6. So, yeah, overall, boys, this is an absolutely amazing card. I got this guy for about 20,000 coins, and aside from the shooting, this is one of the best cards that I've seen in this game. I don't know I'm gonna like this card, lads, because normally I don't like cards that have low shooting, but I really want to test it, you know? I want to I want to see how good or bad the shooting is gonna be, and if it's good, then I've got no doubt this card is gonna be broken. So anyway, boys, let's not waste any time, okay? Let's jump straight to some games. Hopefully things go well today, get some goals, all that good stuff. All right then, boys, jumping into game number one. <laughs> Okay, what the fuck is going on here, boys? What the hell happened here? I don't know if I've managed to get the ball, but we'll take it. Good boy, Simon. All right, that works. And then this to Roy. Okay, that's the most unorthodox assist I've ever seen, but an assist is an assist, so I'll definitely take it. Okay, and then play it through. Oh, that's beautiful. Good boy, this Roy could get a second here. Oh, yes. Oh, I just honestly, lads, if you, I, I love this fucking this Roy. He is an actual goat. Bad, not good, not good. Shit. Oh, for fuck's sake, how am I gonna let him back in it like minutes later? Like, that was literally like a one minute later. Like, that's just bad defending from me. Yes, play that. Oh, boys, what a chance. 
Oh, that's really good from this Roy. Oh, no. Yep, head that, head that. Nice. Oh, that's a woeful touch from Sissoko. If I end up, oh, I am going to concede her, aren't I? No, that's all Sissoko's fault. What was that fucking touch? That was awful. Absolutely needless from Sissoko. I'm going to remember that. You're a no. Okay, what the hell is his defense, lads? I'm sorry, I was 2 0 up. I thought this would be an easy fucking game at that point, and my defense is fucking me up here. What are you guys doing? Oh, referee, can't be doing that. We might might not need it, though. Ref, I want my, no, I want my free kick. Yeah, all right, good. Right, we pass it, and then pass it back, and then Pellegrini bang it. Oh, come on, cross it, cross it. Head it, somebody. Oh, fuck off. Simon, give me that run. Oh, yeah, play it through the middle. Please, Simon, this is the best chance you'll ever get in your life. Oh, that was not a great shot. Okay, can we, oh, no, do. Oh, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, that'll do. That'll fucking do. Simon, give me that fucking run. Come on, Simon. No. I can't get the ball. No, he gets it again. What is this? Head it. Fuck me. Honestly, this game is annoying me today. Yep, head it, head it. Get it. What are you doing, fucking Spinazzola? That was the dumbest shit I've ever seen in my life. It better not, better not end up in a, like, the fucking ball end up in my net or some shit. It actually will, won't it? Like, it'll be my luck. Oh, then you do, what the fuck, Spinazzola? I'm not happy about that. Like, he's just like, he's laying on the floor and shit. And then he's just like, he's left that entire space wide open because he's doing weird stuff. Right, lads, I'm going to need a goal now, like, if I'm going to get back in this. Nice, great ball. Back to, and again. Please, Simon. Oh, that's such a that was a really wank shot. Anyone else would have buried that. I would have put my house on Chiro scoring that, on this story scoring that. Just about anyone. You're a disappointment to your parents, who I fucked. And that's all she wrote, lads. Honestly, I'm a little bit upset with that because you know Simon had a couple of really good chances in this game. Had he buried them, then we would have at least gotten a draw. I don't know why I'm that surprised either because he doesn't have good finishing. So oh, I'm just I'm a little bit annoyed about that, boys. I'm not gonna lie. But you know what, lads? It's early days, okay? He might he might turn it around. He might be good in the next few games. So I'm not gonna trash on him too hard. So anyway, boys, let's jump into game number two. <laughs> Okay. Oh, lads, look at that football. Really good start here, potentially. Come on, Simon. Yes, Simon! That is what I want to fucking see. That is a quality finish on his weak foot. Give me that run, Simon. Oh, yes! Lads, if he fucking scores this, I'm going to love him. Oh, Simon, he took it personally, lads. He took the criticisms on board. And he said, you know what, Michelle? I've got you. I'm going to stick this ball in the net now. And we're fucking four minutes in. He's already got two goals. Nice. Very nice. Oh, that's a good ball. Fuck. Oh, fuck me. Thank God there's no one now, though. There is this guy. Really? Really? I, I thought when he did the first cross, I was like, you know what? We're fine. That was a dead cross. And then he does another one that's just like, oh, my God. Right, come on, Michelle. We, we already bottled a 2 no lead in the first game. Can we not do it again, please? Over the top it. Come on. Come on, Simon. Oh, how? I swear, hang on a minute. That looked like fucking handball. That didn't look like that was in the boxy, eh? You can't be doing that. Oh, what a pass that. No, Mr. Roy, what is that touch? Come on. Come on, Simon, on the volley. Oh, okay. That, that's that, that's just um, that's way too audacious for me to hit that on the volley with someone that has 74 finishing. I've only got myself to blame for that one. Oh, it's fun to Simon. Come on, Simon. For the hat trick. That's the thing, boys. That is the thing. When you keep it simple with Simon, it's in the net. You just can't do anything ridiculous when it comes to finishing. Keep it nice and simple, and it ends up in the back of the net. And I can't really argue with that. Okay, play it. Oh, come on, boys. What? Cross it in. Come on, Aussie Moon. That's a delicious finish. Come on, lads. Oh, and I'm getting a rage quit. Okay, boys. I ain't gonna argue with that. It's time to go! And that's a brilliant performance from the boys, especially Simon. Three goals and an assist. I mean, I'll definitely take that, boys. Four goal dance, lads. I'm obviously thrilled with that. I'm ready to kick it. Give me the seven, you know I'm a flip. It right in this shit like I'm demon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Play it. 
Oh, he's got, oh, look at the look at Nistori in that spec. Oh, it's not even Nistori. That's Simon. Oh, lads, I'm not gonna lie. I, I've, I've misjudged Simon in that first game because this guy can shoot. Like he just can. Like he wasn't good in game one in terms of shooting, but he's more than made up for it. Like later on, that is a difficult finish on the volley, and he's put it in. I mean, I love it. Okay, drop it. Nice. And again, please, Simon. Oh yes. Oh, lads, I love it. I, I Just get this card. Like, what are you doing watching this fucking video? Why are you even wasting your time? Just go buy this card. It's, I mean, you're not going to go wrong with it. He's too good. I love you, bitch. Oh, that's a good pass. Come on. Oh, good defending. Okay. You don't get to say that very often on this channel. Come on, boys. I don't want to concede. No conceding. That's it. Good defend. Keep defending it. Yes, boy. Okay, I'm liking it. I'm liking that good defending in a minute. Nice, what a pass to Aussie man. Oh my god, if that's on side, it's a beautiful pass, and Simon's got himself a fucking hat trick already. What has happened to Simon? Like, he genuinely took it personally when I criticised his finishing. He hasn't missed since, I swear. Alright, good, good boy, Nistoroy. And then over top. Oh, come on, what a pass that is, by the way. Aussie man, it's not the best touch that ended up costing him. Great pass to Nistoroy. Beautiful football. Oh, we've got it back. Come on. Oh, he's giving away. You can't be doing that, lad. All right, big boy Simon. Oh, yes. And he finishes it. Oh, man. That is the literal best finish that you can... Like, he, that could not be more top bins if he tried. I don't know what happened to Simon, lads. He's just turned into the greatest finisher in all of FIFA. Like, oh, out of nowhere. 1v1 me, bitch. I'm fast as fuck, boy! So good. You've got 70 pace, mate. You just outpace Rashford. I mean, I'm not complaining, but fucking hell. What's happened to pace this year? Oh, fuck. That's a really good pass. Come on, lads. Defend. Oh, I thought that went in. Jesus Christ. Oh. Oh, he's missed it. How has he fucking missed that? And play it. What a pass. Come on, Mr. Roy. Lay it off. Oh, yes. And Simon for the fifth. No, no, keeper. Why are you doing that? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Come on, Simon. Use that 94 power look at him, man. He is quick. And he turns with such speed and elegance as well. No, what? How is offside? Don't don't bullshit me, EA. And there we go, boys and girls. What a perfect way to end the episode with a four-goal clean sheet dance. I mean, that is wonderful stuff. Big boy Simon with all of the goals. He just, he really did deliver at the end of this. I mean, like, he just turned crazy all of a sudden. So yeah, four-goal clean sheet dance. That's very, very cheeky. <laughs> Yeah, boys and girls, I really want to talk about Simon, but before we do that, why the fuck has he only got an 8.1 after scoring four goals? Is EA on crack? That is some straight up EA bullshit, like what the hell? But yeah, nevertheless, lads, this Simon card was absolutely incredible, okay? I don't know what happened, like he was really good in game one, but he did have a couple of really good chances that he, I think he should have scored. But after that, lads, he just kicked himself up the arse and said, okay, well, we're never missing again, and he just put everything in the net, and honestly, like, I can't argue with that. And when you add on to that, the fact that this card is blisteringly quick and has some of the best dribbling that I have used, if not the best dribbler I've used so far in this game. Like, the agility and balance on this card is fucking ridiculous, and add the 5 foot 6 into that equation, like, Jesus Christ. This card, lads, should not be slept on, okay? For 20,000 coins, I mean, that is crazy good for the, for the price. So, yeah, I'm gonna run it really cheeky meter, lads. I'm gonna give him a 9 out of 10. Honestly, I, 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 I feel like this card is a 10 out of 10, but that game 1 really did piss me off. Like, he should have scored those goals, and had he done that, this would have been a definite 10 out of 10, so 9 out of 10 for him, not to mention the fact that he's a ball late to link up, okay? This guy took me ages to build a team around him. That aside though, lads, honestly, this is definitely one of the best cards in the game. Definitely one of the best cheap cards in the game. And just do yourself a favour, man. Just get this card because he is broken as all hell. But yeah, I'm going to call it there, boys. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, smash that subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. All right. Peace.